All right, guys, it's Saturday. It's been a while since I made a movie. I had one a little while ago doing some work on the Jeep, um, but it never, YouTube wasn't, I don't know, I kept getting an error. So um, the truck's probably gonna go into the, the upholstery shop next week. I've, I've worked on it. I've done Dynamat inside. I started to put the headliner in, but I didn't like it. It's like it's plastic. It's like PVC plastic. It's really thin. It's cheap. I'm gonna have them do that. Um, I fixed the steering wheel, so as you can see, I shortened it on the column, probably an inch and a half. So that's gonna be big. So anyway, I'm gonna get the interior done maybe next week. You can see I got all the Dynamat in. Um, working on the Jeep today. I did oil change. I put the diff covers on. Forgot to turn the camera on, so anyway, it's um, there's the diff covers. It had hex bolts on it, but the socket wouldn't fit because it's kind of recessed. So I ordered uh, button head Allen's stainless button head Allen's. Let's see, there they are, and uh, of course, those fit perfect. And it actually looks good. Uh, Riddler gear cover cases. Um, so I'm doing an update. This is mostly about the exhaust. Actually, you can kind of see the tailpipe. It's right there. I don't know if I showed a video I modified the tailpipe from what it used to be. So, let me see. It's kind of wet out. Um, let's see here. So it goes up and over the sway bar. And it does not hit that wires in the way so anyway it's a little bit noisier than what I wanted it to be right about 3,000 rpm when I'm climbing it, it's pretty it's pretty noisy inside so um, I bought the Dynamax this is their race series muffler As you can see it straight through so we're working on putting that on today in addition to the muffler that's already on it um, so I'll be cutting probably that pipe out and then pulling the muffler off and finish completely welding it in so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna I'm gonna cut that I marked it already we'll cut it I have the uh, chop saw out here I'm actually gonna cut these off I don't I don't want that on there it's just going to leak if I can't get the pipe in all the way, but... And if I cut it, it makes it that much shorter. Probably an inch. So I'm going to go ahead and cut that up. And I'll bring you guys back. It might be a short video. Next weekend is the 15th and 16th. Uh, it's Winter Fun Fest. Last year I posted the snow video, if you saw my video. Um, this year, of course, I'm bringing my Jeep. Oh, the last video I was trying to update... I put the tail. I put these tail lights on these JW speakers. So those were like a ten-minute deal, but whatever. Um, I also got the rock sliders on from Poison Spider. I put those on. They weren't too big of a deal. Uh, I don't know if I showed you the bumpers on. And this is the light from Rigid. It's called Capture. Of course, it's got my GoPro inside. And I'll Bluetooth that to my phone. And then, of course, this comes off. And it's a high beam and low beam. So anyway, that's where, that's where the Jeep's at. Um, I put the Poison Spider vented grill in there. Let's see. I will... Oh, I got 30 minutes of battery left. I'm going to cut this up. Get the exhaust cut and I'll bring you guys back and I'm going to put the uh, camera on the charger. Clean the truck all up for next week. If it's not raining, I'm going to drive it to the upholstery shop. If it is, then I'll have to do it another time because I'm not driving it in the rain. Alright, so I'll bring you guys back in a bit. Hang tight. Alright, so let me show you where I'm at. That's the pipe. Of course, uh, I cut it too short because I forgot to factor in. I was cutting the... Uh, the, uh, the muffler. So I'll show you what's going underneath here. But, and I can put the piece back. I'll 
I'll just weld it back up. And then that'll be right there. Okay, so you have the muffler. Of course. I guess it would be a, an, a, another muffler. And then it goes out to the tail. And then of course, you know, I'll, I'll adjust it so it's not, it's not rubbing on anything, but that's where I'm at. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get the MIG welder out, and tack that up, and then pull it apart. And then uh, we'll, uh, we'll bring you back. All right, so we're gonna weld this up. I got it off. So actually it's not gonna look too bad. See, I couldn't weld completely because I couldn't get to the top of it when it was in the Jeep. So I'm gonna go ahead and fix that while it's out. Weld all that up. Then I can roll it over and get the rest of it. And then uh, we'll fix that and then should be uh that's the inside. All right, so I'm gonna go uh, weld this up and I'll bring you guys back and then I'll put it on and see how it goes from there. All right, hang tight. All right, it's welded on, took, I don't know, 10 minutes, if you can see. Doesn't look too bad. So hopefully this will be uh, a lot of welds here, but you know what, it's, I don't really care. It fits, it looks good. We'll get it on, get it fired up, and uh, hopefully it gets rid of that. It's not a drone, I guess you say. It's like a. It's right around 28 to 3200 when it's under a pretty good load. It's pr it's pretty loud, and I had buddies say, "Ah, oh, don't worry about it." But you know what? Uh, I don't. I don't like it, so I'm changing it. So I'm gonna get this in and bring you guys back, and then uh, we'll go from there. All right, hang tight. Okay, I got it fitted. It's not welded in yet, but um, looks like it's touching, but when you come over, well, and then of course, up there, the pipe smashed a little bit. That was the factory pipe. It was in a different place. So I, I moved it here when I fitted the tailpipe. But it, it doesn't hit. And you can kind of see where we're at here. Let me move around to the other side and then I'll show you the fitment. there. Well now you can see it's not hitting. Um, where am I at? Oh, right there. Now you can see it's not hitting. But I'll weld it up. I got it all clamped back and then I'll bring you guys back. All right, it's done. Uh, can you see it here? I'm not really sure. Right there, you can see it right there. It's all welded up. That actually didn't turn out too bad. And it's on. There's one muffler, two muffler. So let's see if it's quieter. Start this thing up. a little bit. Oh yeah. 
That's what I'm talking about. And it's free flowing. Uh, the both mufflers are like a glass pack, I guess you could say, but they're stainless, so hopefully they won't rot out. Well, they shouldn't. But there's a uh, go straight through, so yeah, that's awesome. Cool, guys. I think that's about it for Saturday for today. It's a gloomy day. Next week, um, I'll have some snow video, most likely. I rotated the tires, put the spare on here. Um, they gave me steel bolts, so they started rusting, so I put some stainless ones in there now, like the other ones are. So that should be good to go. It's dirty, it's been raining, so I haven't been able to wash it. Plus, we're gonna hit, I'm gonna hit the snow. So that's about it for now. The winch is on, camera's on, poison spider grill. So that's it. Um, next Friday, if I take this down, I'll have a video when I pick it up, most likely. And then look, I have a slow leak. I have to figure out where and why. So that's all for tonight, for tonight, today. Um, yep, project done for right now. I'll catch you back uh, when we get some more work done. Um, February, the bumper will come out of R&D, according to Boys and Spider. And then maybe on the video of that sometime. But hopefully we'll get back to the truck. So hang tight, guys. Uh, I'll be back. Thanks for subscribing, liking, thumbs up. Um, if you guys want any uh, stickers, let me know. PM me, and I'll send you my sticker. All right. Take it easy.